Well, hello there, everyone. Uh, we're back again with another video. This time it's a little something different. It's not shoes. It's not Supreme. It's still clothes. But, um, it's something I didn't think I'd buy because I, I, I saw stuff about the collection coming out and I was like, oh, it's kind of cool, but like, I, you know, like I'm going to be at work or something, so I won't be able to actually go for it. And then I was at the mall the other day, um, at a six, at a Saks Fifth Avenue actually, and they had, a lot of the clothes from the collection there. I was like, wow, that's interesting. Like, let's, like, let's look through this. And it was actually some really good stuff. Um, unfortunately, a lot of stuff they had was like way too big. It was like a lot of extra larges. And I was like, okay, Jesus Christ. Like, I mean, no offense. I used to wear extra large. So I was like, I completely get it. But like, I was just like, wow, like either he really wants to go for like an oversized look or everybody bought everything that was smaller already. Um, Cause the collection has been out for like a week or two at that point, I think. Um, but yeah, I grabbed a hoodie from it. Uh, I think it's a really dope hoodie. Uh, I've never had anything from one of the brands. It's it's a Puma collaboration, so obviously that'll probably give away because it's one of the only Puma collaborations that came out recently. But I've never had anything from Kid Super. Um, didn't even know who Kid Super was before I saw something about the collaboration. So I looked him up a little bit. It's, it's, it seems like a cool dude. Um, cool company, whatever you want to call it. Um, and so I'm really glad I have this in my collection. Probably going to wear the crap out of it this fall because it is it is interesting to say the least my mom and dad don't like it but i think it's pretty cool um it, it's to me it's an interesting take on like a tie-dye but like for a fall time um so here it is here is the kid super puma um hoodie um and whatever you want to call this like pastel paint drop splatter colorway or whatever um is there like an actual like name for this Kid Super Studios, the Puma Kid Super AOP hoodie is what it's called. Um, yeah, I don't think there's a colorway on it either. No, there's not a colorway. Um, I believe the the color code though is TL53447. So if you're interested in looking it up, that's what you should type in. But here is the barcode for it. Um, the interesting thing is. All of them were like this. They didn't have price tags. Like, everything from the collection, like, had price tags ripped off. And it's unusual, because Saks Fifth Avenue usually has the original price tag from the company and their price tag um, on the product. And like I said, they, it was ripped off. And I took it up to her. And I had a rough idea how much it was, because I looked it up. And I, I mean, I couldn't find this exact colorway, but I found the other ones. They were, like, 120 So I was like, okay, I'm assuming, I'm assuming it's the same price. I mean, like, I don't think this would be cheaper. And it shouldn't be more expensive either, because it's all Kid Super. It's all the same kind of hoodie. Um, and yeah, so it was like 140 something after taxes, but she said they, all the tags, all the price tags were taken off. And so she told me like, oh, you know, it should be like around a 140. So it was just interesting. I, I mean, just kind of ranting at that point, but it was just interesting that they had taken off all the price tags. Um, but yeah, this is, this is the hoodie. This is the Kid Super AOC hoodie. Um, like I said, it's got an interesting pattern. It's definitely something different. Um, you're not used to seeing like patterns like this because it does look like somebody kind of like just like splattered like was like dotting off their paintbrush and this is kind of what you got was like this little kind of um pattern um you do have the kid super um like logo with the puma puma <laughs> jumping through it um so that's a nice little touch um you do have little um drawstrings that have like little nice little silver metal tips to them um it does have a good it's like a it's a it's a it's a good weight it's not like a supreme if you wore a supreme hoodie supreme hoodies are like thick and heavy this is it's not as thick or heavy but it is still heavier than like you would normally expect from like gildan or like champion where those are kind of like a softer lighter fleece this is still a little bit of a heavier one so it's a night it'll be a nice one for like later in fall or starting to go into winter when it's a little chillier Put like a long sleeve underneath this, wear this, maybe wear a jean jacket over it, you're good to go. Um, size medium in this fit fit like I needed to. Like I said, I've been going down in sizes, not to flex or anything on haters. But um, going down in size, medium, medium fits well. I don't know if it's oversized. I mean, I went with medium and it fits like it should. I mean, I, I usually, I'm not much of a baggier clothes type of guy just because I'm short so like it looks weird because like it starts going down to like my kneecaps and I'm wearing like a dress or something um but yeah it's it seems to fit pretty true to size so like whatever size you normally wear like a Puma or Adidas or a Nike 
I would go for that make kids super stuff. It seems to fit pretty. It seems like it would fit more like how the Puma clothes would fit rather than like a kid super clothes because I know some kid super stuff might fit a little bit oversized. Um, but yeah, just interesting that it was in a retail store, um, Saks Fifth Avenue. Uh, I don't know if Kid Super is usually like a more like a higher end brand or anything like that. Like I'm just, I've never shopped. I never even heard of Kid Super until a couple days ago when I saw the collaboration was coming out. Um, so I'm not going to act like I know like a bunch of stuff about the, the brand or anything like that. But just thought it was interesting. I um, was really excited to see it because like usually Saks Fifth Avenue, you're like, okay, Versace, okay, Gucci, okay, Louis Vuitton. And I look over in the corner, there's like a bunch of colorful stuff. I'm like, oh, wow, what's that? And it's Kid Super. And I was like, oh, wow, cool um didn't have any of the shoes unfortunately i was gonna look for the shoes because i there was a couple of pairs of the shoes that i kind of enjoyed the way they looked i didn't know if i was gonna grab them but it would have been cool to like see them in person kind of get a good look at them and see how much they were and everything like that but um yeah that's 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 pretty much it i didn't, don't want to rant too much and waste time but that's the kid super puma um aoc hoodie um they had a couple sizes left at my sacks i'm assuming it's still available online i don't know i didn't check to see if it was sold out or not um so it's just something you can look up, Kid Super Puma. If they have it in stock, you're good to go. Um, like I said, I didn't see that colorway online. All I saw was like a, it was like a peach color, like a white color. So I don't know if that's like a in-store exclusive or how they do that, or if that was just sold out online. If it's sold out online, I'm glad I got it because I really enjoy it. Like I said, it's a good mix. It's a good take on tie dye per se. Like it's not tie dye, but it, it kind of is a little bit because you got a bunch of different colors on it. Um, it'll go really good with those space hippies that I showed. Oh, here, actually, I'll just grab them. I have, just, I have them right here next to me. And these would be a good, a good combination because you got the purple right there, purple right there. Mm, can't go wrong, can't go wrong. Um, but anyway, that is it for today's video. I know it's probably going to be a short and sweet one, but I just kind of wanted to give you guys a little glance at the uh, Kid Super. Sorry, I'm trying to put some stuff in a box. Um, the Kid Super Puma hoodie uh, that I was able to get. Like I said, it's like one forty nine after taxes, so it's it's a little bit more of an expensive one. Um, not as expensive as like Supreme hoodies. I mean, but not by much. I mean, <laughs> Supreme hoodies are only like two hundred after shipping and taxes, so it's you're 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 pretty close. Um, like I said, it's good quality stuff though, and it's really it's 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 it'll definitely get some looks and some people will compliment it. I'm sure because it's just different from everything I've ever seen before. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, you can go and drop a like on it. I would appreciate it. Get me good in those algorithms so more people can join our channel. Help me uh, make some more content like this. Get some more stuff out there. Show you guys some cool stuff. Um, comment. Have you heard about Kid Super before? Have, what do you think about the Kid Super Puma collection? Um, go on and comment in the comment section below. I do read all of them. I do reply. I enjoy having a good conversation down there. And uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Sipped it on everything I do upload. Um, those space hippies should be coming um, next week from when this video is dropping. This video, drop, video should be dropping. Or... Yeah, next week. Yeah. Um, so just stay tuned for that. Um, I I do like a full I know I just showed you like two seconds ago, but I do a whole like in depth thing, like, oh look at this and this and this is this what this is. Um so stay tuned for that. So though and then uh oh there's always more Supreme. I'm sure I'll grab some even if I don't like stuff from this week, I'm sure I'll grab something because I'm I'll feel bad if I don't because I'm an idiot for some reason. I don't know why I'm an idiot, but I just am I was born that way, I guess. Um but yeah, thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate you guys tuning in. Hopefully you guys are social distancing, wearing a mask, all that crap. Uh, we just need to get through the rest of this year. Hopefully it starts getting better soon because I would like to go do stuff. And uh, yeah, I'm sure I'll have a, I do have a special announcement at some point in the near future. So you guys only want to stay off, stay tuned for that as well. Uh, it has something to do with uh, something that's not in my room right now. Um, but yeah, it'll be a special announcement. So stay tuned for that. Um, but I do appreciate you guys for watching. And until next time, peace out.